Welcome back to whatever this was. Yep. Uh, John, do you remember who was on which side? I was on the CIS and you that, were on the public. That makes sense. Sticking with your pride. Yeah, <laughs> Apparently it's your turn. Hmm. Well, first I need to build a fleet, it looks like. You're over my planets, John. You have oh, to build okay. Yeah, right, okay. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just used to... I didn't know the colors. <laughs> Thanks, that kind of stuff. Yeah. I'm gonna move there. I'll get back to the swing of things in a moment. I think I'd be a fool not to select sharpshooters, since you can at this point either attack on Kashyyyk or Kamino, both of which are pretty good for sniping. Mm -hmm. well, I've already got snipers. I did win on Kamino, but uh, I was able to get a lot of kills in. We got the same bonus! You know what, let's make it even. Okay! This should make things interesting. Yep. And also, we have upgraded our weapon sets to dual wield. Mm -hmm. You may have noticed our profile names are different than they were in the previous episode. Mm -hmm. Wait, dual wield? I was just having fun. Basically, I'm saying now we got awesome weapons. Yes, we do. I don't know why you've heard of them as dual wield, but yes. We now have the, most of the uh, advanced weapon sets unlocked. Mm hmm. At least for the infantry, I've never been able to unlock the sniper. Maybe unlock the shotgun. I think I'm not Okay, sure. then it should be bad either. I never unlocked the shotgun or the rocket launcher. So this actually puts us at pretty even ground. Let me speak out where that one from in post is. Where the fun begins. I remember this wasn't even like a good edit, but I saw an edit a while back of Obi Wan and, o and Anakin lost, and they point out a map, and then Anakin just points out a point in the map that says where the fun begins, and it shows him smiling. <laughs> and it was so stupid, but I just had to. Yeah, sometimes there's just things that are so stupid you just can't help but laugh at it. Mm -hmm. I would try to come up with a smart example, but uh, I can't think of anything. Else. I hate it when you throw help for your allies and they won't pick it up unless they accidentally run over it. That's why I try to get right in their path and drop it where they're gonna pick it up anyways. Drop it like it's tall. <laughs> well, that's the idea. Yeah. Drop you some. I'll drop you like a bad late night TV sitcom. <laughs> or even worse, a reboot of that same sitcom. Growing pains. Growing pains for the next generation. I was thinking of Fuller House, but yeah. Although that's still going. So. Yeah, just. I didn't think it was that bad, to be honest, but then again, I'm I'm a pretty easily pleased person. I, I mean, I thought the original things. show was good. It was still cheesy as hell, but I like it as a kid. Yeah. The new shows, mm. yeah, that's alright. That's always the way I see it. If you saw something and then said you didn't like it, then I can respect that. But if you say you don't like it but didn't see it, then I'm just kind of like, well, at least well, to be fair, I haven't seen the entire show. I saw the first episode. Yeah, this is exactly what I expected. Okay? Yeah, that's good enough. I love placing a uh, bomb on a turret where they can't shoot me. <laughs> what happened to you? Some guy just dropped a grenade right in front oh. of himself and went flying. I thought it was you along that gun. Like, no, you have the droids. That's another command post under Republican control. Droids. The enemy has taken a command post. Yeah, the fun command post. This is where the puns begin. <laughs> I'm just kidding, if I just I can't really think of any good puns right now. I just realized I ran in the opposite direction of where I meant to go. Yeah, it happens. 
Boy, howdy. It's interesting. Uh, again, I'm thinking in the first game, the AI always like to go in those turrets, but I have to actually see anybody in one of them this time. Give me a guy up there. Oh. On your side, then, I guess. Oh, oh apparently, this guy's in the apparently placing a bomb at the base of the turret doesn't do damage to the turret. I thought it did. I think you have to shoot the top of it. I suppose so. I just always find for Unfortunately, I have a shotgun, so that's not gonna look so well. Yeah. I personally just always went for killing a person in the turret. It always takes Well, that'd be great down. if I could switch to a sniper, but I can't. That awkward moment when you run out of ammo, so just jam the fire button until it finally works. And then your friend comes along and shoots you. While reloading. <laughs> Looks like you're killing it. Command post under attack. Time to bring in the heavy artillery. You know, I was kind of hoping you wouldn't see me. <laughs> I saw, I saw the rolling, and I'm just really like, work. Hmm. Hey, I know who likes rolling. Happy? <laughs> well, yes. If you want to be all technical. It's mine now! It was already yours! It's still mine now! I'd like to point out that in the time it took to kill me, you probably lost valuable time for something else. Yeah, probably. Although, having said that, we actually lost more command, though, so... My strategy didn't quite work. There is no exit strategy. Well... Whenever I used to play this game, I always thought the main achievement was to kill as many people as possible, but... I mean, that's really still kind of how I play. Yeah. But when you go more for command posts, then you realize the numbers start to change. Mm -hmm. That's how you affect the enforcement. Mm -hmm. Hey, I thought I'd just slice into that. What the hell? Maybe they kicked you out. I, I don't know. I don't think it works like that. Oh, you've turned the tide significantly. Yeah! <laughs> and you're still about equal to me. Yep. But I think that's because you deployed the, your garrison as well. Mm. What are you blind to deploy the garrison? What? There was a subtle line from Rogue One. Basically, everything's just exploding and they're just staring at it like, huh, what's going on? And, uh. Actually, Krennic John, I don't think you have deployed your garrison yet. Hmm. When your uh, robot pal was announcing a new guest of troops, he's talking about my guys. Uh oh. Mm. Gee, I sure could use that garrison bonus. To oh wait. You already have them. Well, I'm not sure what you did to turn the tide, John, but it worked. <laughs> yeah, I don't know either. <laughs> Maybe I just have good morale skills. I don't know. Good morale. Yeah, you know, morale for the troops, they're more You're invigorated. robots! You don't have morale! You have pro programming! I, uh, added a new logic chip. That sounds expensive. Yeah, definitely. You might be there a while. Whoa, what the? I just teleported. Teleportation. I mean, I'll take it, but wow. Oh, maybe you did deploy troops already. I don't know. Hard to say. Because if you hadn't, I think you would have shot back up before you hit 27. But all the same, this is definitely a war of attrition. <laughs> Look at these numbers. Well... Yeah. Even so. Are. You've got quite the upper hand right now. Ow. 
I want complete victory. Maybe, I don't know. You're, you're gonna get it, alright? You know what? I'm gonna start having fun now. That was a bad idea. I wanted to be the Magnagar. Oh, what? I can do it now. Sorry. Oh, yeah, I don't have it unlocked yet. Whatever. I believe I'm now the last guy. Yep. Either that or maybe there's like one other. Maybe. I prefer if I wasn't one, because then I could actually rely on myself somewhere. Mm -hmm. Come on, troops, think now. He's our last threat. Oh god, there's an AA tape. Yeah, there's definitely one other guy, because he's capturing one of my clan posts. Ha! Now. I just destroyed your tank with my blaster. <laughs> That's how weak it was. Wow. Yeah. Medical droid, act as cover! Goodbye! Aww. Was that you in the turret? No, I just shot the wrist rocket at the little medical droid. Ah. Well, you know what? I got more kills than you. <laughs> By one. By one. Oh, yeah, well, I got more deaths. <laughs> I also had... I don't know. You know what? I'm okay with that. That was a hard-fought uh, victory for you. Oh, definitely. <laughs> that was close for both of us. Mm. It's more interesting when something like that happens. Okay, let's see. What... Mm. Sabotage bonus is always good. That one happened. That one was pretty good last time. Mm. Mm. Can't, I can't afford either of those. You could buy the uh, Space Marine. Yeah, I wouldn't recommend it, though. Mm. Yeah, I think I'll just... Because that really only affects you. Mm -hmm. I think sabotage will work pretty good. Why? Why would you sabotage me? John, you're the one with all tanks. you're the one with all the vehicles. You have some, don't you? No, we have a few hover bikes, that's it. Okay, wait, no, I might be wrong. But even so, that's gonna affect you a lot more than it is me. I would've used Gavis on that, man. Oh well. You use the sabotage on me, I use the sabotage on you. Once so. again, yeah, Neither I Neither sides have vehicles. <laughs> well they might, it just will take a while. Mm-hmm. Also, we have Wookiees, so that would kind of kind of balance the Gaussian thing anyway. Maybe. Maybe. I'm not really sure how... I know for sure the Ewoks are a great help if you're going for, uh... Going planet. Yeah. Oh yeah, you're right. We do have one tank. So I thought you had something. You know, I probably should have prepared this first. Do it. Bye! I'm going this way. <laughs> They've reached the sea wall. Brace yourselves. That hasn't happened yet. I know. It will, I'm sure, but you know. Yeah, the wooden barricades are basically supposed to be in the zone. Just gonna see how far I can go with this. <laughs> Thinking of Not that far. Okay, admittedly, that could have gone smoother. <laughs> I'll say both of us were pretty battle damage from that. Yeah. Let's see if I can find a nice little sniper boost. Right before I fire the rocket, the thing I'm aiming at gets killed anyway. I'll say this, you're probably a better sniper than I am. I'm much better at the stationary target, so yeah. there's not a lot of... Drones for that. Drones, turrets. <laughs> you know what's funny is I can repair the wooden walls with my uh, arc welder, which doesn't make any sense at all, but I can. Oh yeah, I forget the kind of uh, dumbed down with the sniper's ability to be able to do. Like uh, in the original game, you get one of those recon droids, which you can use to 
signal of Raj if you want. Same of Raj. Yeah, basically, just kind of the. Hmm. I know. I'm not really good in this version, today, the droids explode, but they're tied to the commander of the class, not the snipers. Yeah. You gotta just stick with the old standby. Good old artillery. Artillery. Not the standard trooper. Oh, infantry. Artillery would be a cannon. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not very good with words today, for some reason. Have you tried being better with words? I'm trying. Have you tried harder? <laughs> so, I'll see what I'm I I'm not mean. really sure where I'm going with this. Nowhere. Yes. Ow. I'm a, dis a bit disappointed that when you see the bits of a destroyed vehicle, it doesn't act as like cover as long as it's there. Yeah, that would be interesting. You think that would be a feature in the newer games, but uh, I don't think so. <laughs> but the newer games have their own problems. Yeah. Aside from the microtransaction stuff, I think I mentioned this last time, but I played the uh, demo of Battlefront of the new Battlefront game, and it's just not that fun. And this is before the transaction thing came in, came into it. Mm. I do hate being the defenders on this planet because it's so hard to hold. Man post three. You can just attack from all directions. I think that's probably intentional because it's supposed to be sort of a last stand scenario. Yeah. One of which the Republic would win out, but you know, it's supposed to be like one of the worst battles in the war. That was always kind of one of the darker things about Star Wars. Is at the end when Palpatine orders Order sixty six, mm -hmm. they were both on the same side all along anyway. Mm -hmm. So it's just like everything was a waste of time. Oh yeah, they say so in uh, in the campaign. It's like we left as heroes. Years later, we returned as conquerors. Yeah, that was always a good line. Twice. I always kind of liked it when they talked about Ayla Sakura, where it's just like, oh, but her time came. It was quick. She deserved that much. Implying that yeah, they're going to be the ones responsible for that. Yep. Well, I destroyed your bridge for a little bit. I mean, your little door for a little bit. So, yeah. Oh, man. It was close. It wasn't that close. I was pretty good. Still, I didn't realize it was you. The one with a conscience. <laughs> and who's choosing not to use it. Yep. Bye. Oh, the wiki did that? I thought I did. It looks like it. Oh, well. Oh, my God. I just realized my reinforcement count was dangerously low. Wookiees, you're not pulling your weight. To be honest, I'm pretty surprised that we anyone was able to capture any other command post. I thought it was just going to be both of us would have our command posts and then it would be nah, the dude. to kill the other side. Command post three switches off so often. <laughs> I'll be honest, I'm not a huge fan of the sheet. I kind of like the original map better. Well, when I say original, I mean from the I know first what you mean. So I'm pretty sure there are probably other Kashyyyk maps before that. I was wondering. I'm not sure what game you're playing to that. Yeah, I just said. Yeah, exactly. I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Probably one of those more obscure expanded universe titles. Oh. Huh. Okay, so in killing the Wookiees, that doesn't deplete any of your no, reinforcements. Doesn't. The reinforcements only refer to clone troopers, not Wookiees. Yeah. Same goes for the Ewoks if you're fighting rebels. Makes sense. Or the and Jawas on, uh... You know. Naboo. No. Oh. Jawas don't live on Naboo. Oh. <laughs> that too, oh, that's what I was really mixed up. Mixed up. Hey, I couldn't think of but yeah, it's considered... Damn. Hold on. Uh, it's considered uh, friendly fire if you kill a Jawa, even though it's technically on both sides. 
Yeah, they're a neutral thing. Yeah, I think that's basically like the punishing you for shooting a civilian. Yep. But then I could have put in like human civilians because that'd be too dark. So it's like, yeah, we'll just put in this diminutive alien species. No one's gonna care. Okay, John, I'm gonna make a deal with you. You don't attack Kamino, and I'm not gonna attack Kashyyyk over and over until I get it back. All right. Because frankly, that'd just be boring. Yeah. We have a turn limit though, but still, that would, yeah. that would be boring. Well, first you gotta create a. Uh... Yeah. Crap! So you got Camino or... I didn't realize you were so far ahead of me. Oh, there's two over there. Yeah. I didn't know either. Okay, well. Since this is going to be a space battle... <laughs> oh crap, I didn't buy that. <laughs> oh well, we'll see how this goes. Yep. What do you mean I can't put the garrison bonus? <laughs> that wouldn't make any sense, to be honest. No. I mean, it's not like, hey, another ship flew by and now they're assisting you in the battle. That'd be pretty cool. On the map, space, which doesn't have specific. Even though there are, like, what are the five, six different space battles you can choose from? There's six different layouts, and they vary from planet to planet. And if you're in any planet that doesn't have one of those, you'll just choose one at random. And I think the backdrop in the, uh, of space itself will look different. I think this is the space my Vito said. Just as long as it's not Space Mustafar, I think that's one of the asteroids everywhere. I don't think Space Mustafar is a planet. Not naturally. You can't select that from the internet. I'm trying to think which one I'm thinking of. Uh, the one with asteroids? Maybe off that asteroid. Oh, there is a mission where you're in the space of Mustafar, and that does have asteroids in it. It's not a map you can select, though. It's dumb. Oh, son of a... Too close. Ugh. At least that was on your accord and not one of the enemy's accord. I mean, one of your comrades' accords. I always hate it when that happens. It's just like, yes, I finally landed the ship. And then it just t immediately takes off and kills everyone. Ah! Come on, man! <laughs> I didn't think it was gonna hit anything, but I'm gonna to try. Do you have auto targeting? What did you expect? Just gonna make sure everybody's out of the ship. Everybody out. Unfortunately, I can't deploy bombs in my own hangar. Sense. I hate the droid gunship because guess what? You can't place bombs on easily. Look, it's like hovering just below the thing. Oh, you still did it. Yeah, but. It doesn't look like it should work. We're blowing holes in my ship. <laughs> See if you can guess what movie that's from. It's Pirates of the Caribbean, huh? Yep. I'm just gonna go for it. <laughs> Wait a second, do I not have... Oh, I didn't, mind. Yeah, you just need to switch to it. Yeah. I'm back! <laughs> I can do this all day, buddy. Something tells me this is gonna be the whole battle, just both of us <laughs> kill each other. <laughs> this is why I got the Marines! <laughs> I'm sorry, what? Oh. <laughs> And now, Hank. <laughs> now, Hank. Ow, Hank. Plus, the enemy's auto defense system. No. Not that it really does too much, I think, but still, it's the thought that counts. Yeah. Oh, it does stuff. Makes it a lot harder for you to approach it, but still, I can. Please get out. This is the worst, because I can't really stop you easily. I'm surprised I made it that far, to be honest. Wow. <laughs> okay, Did you yeah. destroy my ship? Oh, no, that's the wall. Whoops. <laughs> I accidentally killed one of my allies.
You'll be able to get to my ship a lot faster and something like that. What? You'll be able to get to my ship a lot faster and something like that. That and I also repaired the thing, so I'm not going to crash into that. Mm -hmm. Yay. I'm gonna change it up a little bit and destroy the rest from the outside. As soon as I get this show, I'm gonna take it. So I think your auto turret shot the bomb that I placed on your uh, life support terminal. I don't think I've ever seen that happen before. Nor have I. Um, they already have. <laughs> yeah. I may have mentioned this last time, but I believe the droid starfighters are not actually like starfighters that you can get in and fly. They're literally droids of their own uh, volition. They're functionally starfighters, but they don't require pilots. They're just autonomous drones. Which I think is very cool. Yeah, that was a pretty interesting feature. But then it makes the concept of a pilot droid kind of inaccurate. So by all, you know... By all logic, John, you should not exist right now. No. And then I just mysteriously fade away. You do like a tiny uh, back to the future kind of thing? Yep. Just lift my hand up and then the controller falls through. <laughs> well, that would certainly give me the edge I need to win. <laughs> yep. Just completely erase the other guy out of existence. It's an unusual tactic, but it works surprisingly well. Well, it appears we both went for the same idea. <laughs> yeah, this has always been my I was kind of half thought whenever you drove in the uh, enemy, enemy craft, so to speak, they kind of thought you were friendly, but I'm not really sure if the AI or the team treats you any different. No. Like, if we target each other out here, we'll recognize each other's enemies. Yeah. You know, it goes to me, you might just be a better pilot than I am. Yeah, I was able to mass a pretty big army within your ship, and now it's just a giant virus taking over. Oh no! Thank you, what's the pump? There we go. What the heck are you? I'm not sure. <laughs> I mean, I can state the obvious and say I'm somewhere in time and space, but that doesn't apply to anything. Ah, there you are. No, oh, not everything. Okay, that was just an enemy ship. Okay, I feel like the tri bomb is actually better than the Jedi Starfire. Which, by the way, I should not be using! I love Vertigo. <laughs> Yeah, no, with the split screen, I'm having a hard time, actually, like, keeping... Uh, I know the life support's underneath the ship, but I can't see it. Dude, you already destroyed my life support. Oh. You? It looks like you did. It must have been somebody else that did that. Why can't I hit you, man? 
Don't even hit me a lot. Okay, but you're not dead is my point. Even see what killed me, just that Alex died. Oh my god, your droid ship is still freaking active! Yes. I didn't just. <laughs> oh yeah. yeah. Just because you flipped the screen upside down doesn't flip gravity upside down. What? You see, I was trying to attack your life support system from upside down, and then all of a sudden all the bombs went up instead of into the system. Really, the bombs shouldn't even have that trajectory because there's no gravity in space. Exactly. Unless maybe it's supposed to be kind of like how the sun is a gravitational pull because it's so big, but uh, these things are barely the size of the sun. Yeah. Okay, well that's finally dead. Now that's gonna make a difference. It's too late. It's just damage is done. Oh yeah, it is. So it doesn't it doesn't list them as such in game, but the Republic uh, command ships in this game are technically Star Destroyers. Oh, definitely, just painted different colors, really. Mm -hmm. Well, painted. I mean, the Star Destroyers are just gray, well, yeah. like that, and like that, of course. How convenient! Convenient still. Well, the gray on our screen. On your screen, it's probably going to be gray. It's going to be a more rich gray. More rich? Is it? Yes. Alright, I think we better take a little bit of a break there. Mm -hmm. Next time, I'll probably lose some more. Well, we'll see. He might be pushing back the offensive a little bit.